Folks, this is Wayne Art back with another lesson, and we've got an amazing song again today. We've got the Seahorses and Blinded by the Sun. If you're not familiar with the Seahorses, they were a band that John Squire of the Stone Roses put together in sort of the mid 90s, just after the Stone Roses had split, uh, you know, about 95 at that time. And uh, this is based on the way that Chris Allen, the singer of that band, plays it acoustically. I think it works really well. No bar chords, so it's pretty easy to play all open chords. Uh, if you do want the chords, the lyrics and the strumming pattern to this, uh, I'm going to post it up on my Patreon page. I'm going to put a little link to that in the description below. So not only will you get access to that, uh, a lot of the other lessons I do as well, I always put my notes and the strumming patterns up, as well as, as some exclusive sort of riffs and tab and good fun things that aren't currently up on YouTube. So like I say, if you want to go and check that out, you can pledge as little as a couple of quid a month and you know any pledge would really help me out. It would be very much appreciated. Uh, thanks everyone who subscribed and continues to do so if you are subscribed a third way you could help me out that way is uh, hitting the little notification bell that's somewhere down there and uh, I really appreciate it if you gave me a like on social media so I'm Wayne Our Guitar on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and now also TikTok as you always say trying to get down with the kids but uh, that's enough of me rambling without further ado let's get to it. Okay so the song is in standard tuning but as you can see for this acoustic version you're going to want the capo up on the second fret okay. Uh, now the intro that Chris Allen does when he plays this live he just plays an E and an E7 so you get this. So from a normal E chord going to that E7 we're just going to take the third finger off so. Okay. Uh, now obviously the recording does it in a slightly different way, I'm going to post the chords up to that on my Patreon page so if you want to do the proper intro you can also get access to that as well, but for the sakes of the acoustic version that's the way that I play and the way that Chris Allen plays it. Okay. Uh, so then we go into the verse, so we start off with the same two chords, the E and the E7, then we're going to go to an A, into an A minor and then that repeats again okay so I'll just sing that through so you can see how that gels together how would you feel if I was to feel right down that's the A to an A man touch your feet right now is the way it's going to be from now until forever so much less to get it clever with and this little instrumental part so we're just going to play an E and we stop there on a B7 okay and we go back into reverse Who would you play for the A, A minor is it me there is no doubt We're going to go to a G to a D, so I'm using the, you know, the four finger G. And 
and then we've got the chorus which is an A minor a C now I played a C in my version with a, with a G bass in it sounds a little bit meatier if you want to do that all that would be is taking a C chord moving your third finger to the third fret and the low E string relative to the capo little pinky third fret of the A string you don't have to you just play a normal C so again we've got an A minor a C a G a D that goes around again we've got A minor C G D the end of that chorus we're going to go A minor F major 7 C and then an E at the end of that so I'm going to sing that through so just to quickly mention the F major 7 that I use I use this in a lot of my videos if you take a regular, a regular F major 7 all that would take is similar to what we did on the C we're going to move the third finger to the third fret on the A string relative to the capo little pinky third fret on the D Got a lovely sounding uh, F chord so I'll just sing that chorus through, so starting with the A minor. You're wasting your time, from my time as well. I love that living a lot against the time itself. You're making excuses for the things you've never done. Walking on circles, blinding. Okay, and that takes us into another verse and another chorus. Okay, so after that second chorus, we've just got this outro. Now the chords for that are a C, an E, and an F major seven. So the F goes for two bars. So I'll just sing that so you can see how that jolts together. So I don't mean to sound unkind to you. You'll just have to go and find something. on an E minor okay so that is pretty much the meat and potatoes of the song uh, now the strumming pattern most of these chords go a bar so I use one that I use in loads of my videos uh, I add a few extra flicks in here and there but I always do give a guide pattern because I know a lot of people struggle with strumming so I tend to use a down down up down up down 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 so Again, down, down, or down, or down, down, down. And that is pretty much all you're going to need. Okay, so thanks very much for watching. Hope you all dug that, and thanks everyone who requested that song. Brilliant song, and brings back some great memories to me. Uh, you know, obviously the mid '90s. What a what a time for music and culture and uh, you know even football was better back then everything was just uh, almost like the swinging 60s again not as I was around in the 60s but um, you know judging by what happened in the 90s everyone said that was alive in the 60s it was like that period again so but I thoroughly enjoyed it and I'm glad I was alive then sort of in my prime and that's what sort of gelled me into the musician that I am today so uh, like I say I hope you all dug that thanks everyone who requested that uh, if you've got any other requests for any other, not just Seahorses songs or Britpop songs, 
Uh, any from 50s to modern day that's going to work well on an acoustic guitar or an electric or do the odd electric guitar lesson here and there. So the easiest way to get your request in is obviously comment in the post below or if you want to find me a personal message over via social media on those platforms I suggested at the start of the video, you're very welcome to requesting a song. I just have to point out that I do have to handpick them a little bit because I do get quite a lot but don't let that put you off. Uh, please do keep your requests coming because that's what keeps this channel going and it's very much appreciated. Uh, also thanks everyone who's subscribed as i said in the intro if you are subscribed you know i talked about hitting the little notification bell that really does help me out because obviously you get notified every time i post a video up and you can keep up to date also i always say word of mouth is a powerful thing so please like and share my videos if you dig what i do tell your friends tell your work colleagues anyone you know who plays a guitar point them in my direction i'd really appreciate that so that just leaves me to say have a great morning day night Whenever it is you're watching, and I'll catch you all for a lesson very soon. Take care.